Hi guys, um, this is basically just a video to update uh, what I've been up to. So more of a um, modding log, I guess. So I've been trying to use the uh, ESC to um, do the controlling of the pusher for um, burst fire sort of modification like the rapid strike. So I finally sat down to write some programs and do some testing. So this is my uh, more or less my first phase, I guess. So this time around I use the ESC so I just arm it for the um, push over here and this time around I use the OLED display so I can uh, display more information like uh, on the top bar is basically the battery life if you look closely you can see the voltage the um, type of firing this is single shot and I have a uh, 18 Mac uh, configured so again single shot okay I can also configure it to burst Mm. Yeah, so it's a three round burst. Just like my uh, rapid strike, I can uh, have more bursts like four. I can have five. And of course, uh, if you're left with one, you'll just fire off. Uh, I can also make it into two bursts. So I can, of course, the next mode will be 4 auto. I need to reset the uh, counter. So if the magazine is out, it's going to say uh, Mac out, and you can configure the ammo as well. Uh, so far it's uh, I can actually find adjust it by uh, hitting uh, the trigger to find adjust it. Let's say to 26 or 27. You can go up and down. It's actually there's another button for down. Okay, I think this this one is just to rotate to the presets. So I'm just gonna go for 22 this time around. Okay, so now I'm in full auto mode. You still go. Yep. So for full auto mode, uh, just like the one I did for the rapid strike, I want to have to have some more uh, configuration like RF I can give it to a maximum RF over here this is standard maximum okay so I can go for maximum RF and you go yeah so this is what I've been up to so basically this is just a testing uh, to see if uh, it works so basically I just have to do more testing because uh, the broken and road I didn't really test it uh, that thoroughly for example, uh, now the battery life is actually full. Uh, it's about 12.5 now. I, uh, so what happens if the battery is like 11.1? .1, will it still work with the current programming and things like that? Then of course I want to clean it up. So, and uh, last of course I need to figure a way out to fit everything in. So if I will continue on this project, um, once I'm done with everything, just like the rapid strike, uh, I will upload the code as well once uh, everything is more stable and I've tested it enough and I've tried fitting in everything then I can uh, release the code as well as a uh, part list and uh, things as such so um, if you like what you see do subscribe to my channel and follow my progress um, I might be a bit, little bit slow because what I wanted to do is to, again to pick up a new skill maybe to do some 3D printing and uh, 3D modeling for this project so uh, my progress probably will be slow uh, because it's a new skill that I want to pick up and maybe implement in this uh, modding yeah so if you like what you see do subscribe to my channel and uh, hopefully uh, I can progress and update your guys about the project so thanks for watching I'm Tungsten